on to the next game. Garrett versus B. I'm going to be spectating B at first. Uh, and yeah, let's get straight to it. By the way, Tristan's car was a dingo from that last game. Alright, we're live here as my voice just came in. Holy what a shot by B. Sorry, Colin. That's the shot of the game now. Or not game. Shot of the tournament. B's up 1-0 on Night Dawn. Garrett did say going into this game that he didn't feel as confident. It is best out of three because it's the... No, it's not the semis. It is not the semis yet. I take that back. It's only one game. Garrett uh, was having a conversation with me off camera. And he was saying that he definitely likes best out of threes better in case he has that one bad nope. game. Saved by B there. Which I definitely agree with him. I was having an interview with a few of the players. I wish I got some of the interviews on camera, but I did not. Nope. People were really hyped for this tournament. It was about a week in advance. A lot of planning going into it. Uh, not a lot of planning into it, more like. We had to kind of just wing it, you know? Like, there was planning into it, but not a lot of preparing is what I meant. Garrett definitely had his time in his training and his ones. Really good shot there, not going to lie with you. Couldn't happen. Three, to, or three minutes and 50 seconds left. One zero B. Trying to make a 2-0 here. It ain't going to happen. And I'm going to switch to a different commentary day. In the middle of this game, which is going to be 250. Won't matter for you guys. Middle is not 250, it's 230, by the way. Uh, Garrett trying to score, not going to happen. B has an opportunity. Garrett's coming back fast, and B's going to put it right in. How much you could do about that? 330 left in the game. Garrett trying to hit the ball, trying to get some momentum here. He needs this one to move on to the semis. Fortunately, you're going to play Colin or the winner of the other game, which is. It's going to be me, so he's going to play me or Colin in the next round. So, uh, I think I lied. I don't think Colin's going to play me. To be completely honest with you, I don't know who's going to play who after this matchup. But we'll get to it in a minute. But I believe you got to go through Colin to get to the finals. So, uh, one-way ticket to hell here from the winner of this game. But they don't want to think about that right now as B missed an open goal there. Which is going to cost him later in the game, probably. Garrett trying to get his momentum going into the next or second half of this game with an interesting attempt. Going for the bump now, which didn't work. He's rushing back as he probably should be. Gets the clear. And on to the next day of commentary. Alright, we're back here as Nighton takes a shot on a. Uh Want a veil there, or whatever they call it. Not Javel. <laughs> All right, two t or 220 left in the game. He gets the ball off of steel. He's going to put it in. I don't have to the extra point. B is going to get the goal right back. Now it's 2-3 with exactly two minutes left in the game. Two for seven on the day for Night Dawn. Not shooting a great day. Going for a ceiling shot. A little bit too slow. Almost got the flip reset. Gets the fake on B. Could not get the hit. Goes for the ball. B sends it down court. You guys kind of can see what's happening, so I don't really have to commentary everything here. But it's actually pretty interesting, to be completely honest with you, to do it. I don't know what that was. I am spectating a lot of Night Dawn here. During the recording, I was uh, watching his play because I was rooting for him in this game. No offense to B. Because I knew if I stayed in, I think I was in it still at this point. And I would play Night Dawn. That's why I was rooting for him. B's up two with a minute and ten or a minute twenty left. Not looking too sweet for Night Dawn. This is going for another ceiling shot down two. Not going to work. B's going to get the shot and that's going to go in. Two to five. Less than a minute remaining now. Night Dawn's trying to do something with his two and eight shooting day. Not, not a great game for Night Dawn if he can get out of this one. Be very surprising. B's taking it down court. Or down field more like. <laughs> Gary Steele's. Taking it in. That's a walking goal. 3-5. Don't call this one out yet. Lucky kickoff. Goes Knight Dawn's way. And he can finish. Now 4-5. to five. Perfect recording once again. Good kickoff. 5-7 for seven for B. He's shooting well. Four saves, almost his fifth. Ties up the game after it being two to five. 
I know you two were watching. Just put a lot of fight into this game. 18 seconds left. Three straight from Night Dawn. Three unanswered, as they say, in the big leagues. Gets blown up. He is part of the Nub clan. That is my clan. I own it with about 20 of my friends, which is surprising. And this game is barely going to go into OT, but it's going to go into OT. Holy. That did count as a shot for B. Tucson gets into OT here. B's got to get something going. Three unanswered. Garrett faking out the camera, man. Gets around B, gets the lucky pinch. And Garrett is moving on to the next round. What a game. What you think about that one? Oh, wait, I forgot I'm commentating alone. I looked over to my right like I was commentating with someone. Let me know if you guys ever want me to do commentary things like this with a co-host or something. Whenever Mo decides to come back from uh, Honduras, he can be. Look at that beautiful shot. On to the next one. All right, here we are. Oh, God. Here goes me versus Colin. This is to go into the semifinals. As Colin gets the very easy goal. Next goal. Uh, another very easy goal. Alright. Gets a decent 50 there. Lining up two goals. Almost a third on the first 20 seconds of this game is never a good start. I got my blue dom. Rocking with it. Couldn't get the pinch. Got to go for those. Go to go for those shots against Colin. He doesn't uh, let anything easy come up against him. So you guys have figured out this tournament so far. This is for the semifinals. Very good flick there by uh, Colin. A little double redirect there, almost a save. Interesting play. I'm trying to dribble it. Nothing going to happen. Gets by him, but sadly, I don't have a teammate. <laughs> I'm going to get the boost instead of the ball, which is... I got to hit it off the wall here. Pass to Colin, unfortunately. Playing a lot of defense this game because I can't do much offense. Gets the, gets the lock. 340 left in the game. And that goes right over top of me. Fake him out there a little bit. Takes the ball down court. I'm going to try to pinch it here. Oh, nope. Takes it, passes, but I know I'm going to get there first. Trying to just control the ball here. Find the way into that blue goal right there with my blue dom. Probably went, should have went with the blow-up play there, but decided to stay back. Just realized how close I am to my screen. Couldn't get a pinch play. God, saved by... Prometheus. I definitely did not say that right. I'm stuck in my own goal here. And I'm back. Gets the save, but right back to Colin. Now it's 3 zip, 240 left in the game. 4. Would have been 4 zip there, but an unfortunate error. Probably the only one of the game. I'm going to go with the dribble play here. Gets a decent on my car. Going for the flick. Good play. Not going to happen off the backboard. It's kind of my luck this game. Turnaround shot. Colin gets an unorganized play. And it's going to be a interesting goal. Fireworks going off for that one. Because that was kind of the only goal I'm probably going to have this tournament. Against Colin. I would play him in the semis as well. Actually, no, I wouldn't. Play him in the finals if I win again. But that's if I win this game. There's the stats on your screen. I'm not having a great game again. Didn't really have a good game the first game, but still came back. Actually, I had a really good game against B, what am I saying? Really good shot there. Easy save, though. Doesn't really make much sense, but sorry. Right. Whoa, Colin goes right by me. Gives me a love tap. And controlling the ball very well. I'm going to go for the pinch play almost into my own net, and it's going to count as a save somehow. I got one minute and 30 seconds here to make something work. Colin's dribbling it. I'm 
Not much is happening here. Just kind of going back and forth right now, trying to find the right, right hole here. I fake out the myself, and I just nothing is happening. This game is looking like a bunch of bronzes, which is really surprising because he's the champion. Until that happens, no bronze in him. I'm a D1 or something like that. I think I'm actually a plat one in ones, but D1 in the game, D2. Colin's like a champ one, almost champ two. Actually, champ two, almost champ three, my apologies. So this matchup doesn't really equal out here, and I'm looking at it. It's only a two-point game. I'm going for the pinch play. Got to get for a lucky bounce. Not going to work. Definitely going to have that happen. Colin's almost going to get a goal on the way back. Still have only gave up three goals in four and a half minutes. I'm very happy with that myself. Hit it over top of him. I got to go with the lucky bounce here. And it's going to work. The lucky bounce works. I mean, not lucky. I planned that out, but still. What a play. I'm still in this game. Two minutes left. I think I would know who won this game if I'm commentating my own voice, but hey. I'm pretending like I don't. Because I'm a mixtape, you know. Gets the save. If I was saying I have Colin leaving the... No, he's not. I have one opportunity with one second left on the clock. Yeah, that didn't work. That's GG's Colin to the semis. On to the next game.